Hello, my name is Rajesh Talesra and welcome to my YouTube channel. So this is another series announcement. In this, we'll be creating Rails APIs and React. So basically, it's a full stack application that we'll be creating. And uh, the requirements for this is anyone who knows HTML, CSS and JavaScript can work on it. I would personally recommend someone who has a bit of experience in React or in Rails, uh, either one of these should definitely watch this series and someone who has viewed my Airbnb clone series uh, should also definitely watch this series because they will get a very different perspective of how to create a full stack application. Uh, I know there is a debate that why Rails plus React is not the best combination with Rails 7 coming up. Uh, but those discussions aside, actually it is the most demanding job in Rails world. Uh, so I would highly recommend you to, to, to know this and everyone knows that creating APIs in Rails is really easy. So yeah, what all things we'll be covering in this? We'll be covering authentication. Uh, we'll be using JWD tokens. Uh, don't worry if you don't know any of these things, we'll be covering everything from scratch in this video series, okay? And we'll be using Tailwind CSS along with Rails and React, we'll be using Tailwind CSS. And uh, yeah, uh, a lot of other things we'll be using. I'll give a quick demo of the product that we'll be focusing on. Uh, it's not a fully finished product, but in our video series, we will have much more detail, uh, much more finished product. So let's see. This is the product related to code challenges. Now you can see it has a front end basic details and all those things. Now these are challenges that I have mentioned. For example, I can log out from here. Let's go to sign in, add some details and sign in. Okay. Now we have signed in successfully. In this, let's have a look at one of the challenges. This is one of the challenges, random new challenge. Now this is an upcoming challenge. Uh, we can register for this, let's say I have registered. Uh, but you can see I cannot submit any solution or anything because the challenge is not yet started. I have mentioned all the details, everything in detail. Now let's go to another challenge, which is this one. In this, I have already participated, so I I can just submit the solution by mentioning the code URL, website URL, and comment. Okay, and again we have all the details here. Uh, UI can be improved a lot, but yeah, these are the details. And because I am an admin user, I can add challenges also. So let's try to add another challenge, color palette generator, and we'll use this entire description. Okay, so this is a rich text, okay, because it has, it just doesn't have plain text, it has headings, it has links, it has external links, bold, italic, those kind of things, and that's why it is called a rich text. <clears throat> we have date picker also, so for example, for this particular challenge, I will select from June, July, and let's add this challenge, and on home page, you can see color palette generator, right, let's click, and you can see it's an upcoming from 28th June to 26th July, so all these things we will be covering in our project all the APIs will be created in Rails and authentication part and everything will be done in Rails. So do let me know if you are excited about this. Uh, definitely comment down below so that I can know how many people are interested in this and share it with your friends. Thank you. Bye bye.